Hello everyone, this is Fawad. Welcome back to Ron Cloud. Fortunate on Azure video series. In our previous video, we have deployed internal load balancer and we have verified as well our traffic was passing through the external interfaces of the firewall and we have reboot and test the traffic is switching over to active firewall. So now we are going to configure our external load balancer. Let's jump on our Azure portal on load balancer. LB. Public because it is our internal load balancer. The front end IP will be IP address. And let me public IP. L This is our front end. This will be our IP Fine. Redundant. Save. Okay, so the backend pool will be the external interface IP. It'll be pool. The network will be FOC network and and pool IP address ten dot four dot five. So firewall one will be ten dot four. Firewall two five. Let me show you from the firewall two as well. So this is the backend pool ten dot four for firewall one because it is facing or ELB. It is the backend. Front end is the public IP and backend is the external interface of the firewall. Ten dot four and five will. Be with ten dot five, right? So both IP addresses are here. So far, leave holes. Similarly, what we have configured for internal load balancers, same thing we have to put for external load balancers as well. Like internal load balancers, we have configured health probe on the firewall side again, port. Verified earlier it was showing unhealthy, but now both are showing healthy because go on the firewall side as well for internal load balancer for firewall the internal interfaces. As we are going to configure our external load balancers, so we have to figure the same thing the firewall for external interfaces as well. Let's jump on. Unpack system interface edit port one. 
and allow first show health probe probe response is not configured here and use append command otherwise if you that command you have to type ping it yes ssh and health probe if you type append append probe response allow access probe response okay done now you need to configure a static route for your internal interface as we have for internal interface we own it set it for our so it stop external interface so now we have defined for external as well so this is done so external load balancer ready for the configuration so this is the ip address of our load balancer so whenever the vm is trying to communicate the outside it should get internal load balancer ip so far it is passing through from wall 2 this is the ip address of our refresh the page will not give you an access to the external IP because the outbound role is not configured yet. Let's go ahead and configure outbound probe first. LB probe. It is right. All four dead double zero. Okay, load balancing role. Get out. So this is what we configure in order to forward our production environment traffic the load balancer. LB outbound. So this is the front end IP protocol all back end pool will be back pool. This is the and goes by maximum ten. Not many. All right, so here we have configured LB outbound role for front end IP. Okay, so why we are not able to add this outbound rule because our firewall one and firewall two both are configured with the public IP address and we have to remove that public IP so that traffic will forward towards the external load so that is the reason we are there so let me go ahead and public ip both firewalls and in this way you will lose access just keep because i am pressing it external interface this public ip address don't want to lose this access you can map Public IP on and interface so far. Let it go because I can still access it through the private IP address. Then zero, right? Don't worry about it. If you have access on your servers through the jump host, will can access your server by wall. Let me remove this public IP.
similarly from firewall 2 as well this is my internal and go ahead Okay, so now it's done. Don't have public IP on both firewalls. Okay, public IP is not available on firewall one. One on fresh. Okay, so Nick one or firewall two public IP. So let me go ahead and configure the outbound group again. So if you look at our M, let's put the action. So traffic is not passing internet at the top for our production machine. So let's configure LB outbound role our front IP second pole. Or no. Now it should not give us an error or go good now. So let's should stop. wall Fine. Okay. So it will not found over the ping, but it should not as access. Okay, so here you can see 65.180 is the public IP address at the moment. Of it. Public IP of our external load. So here you can see 65.180 six of our public IP and 65.180 is public IP address. So it proved that our traffic is passing balancer. Let's run the trace command. Further verify right now the traffic is passing through from firewall two. So let me go ahead and read the firewall two. This is firewall. I am not successful through the public IP because I just removed site net firewall one. Five is my firewall two. Let me go ahead with rewrite this because I wanted to reboot this firewall. System reboot was here. You can see 20.5. This is 20.5. So, so that the traffic should pass through from firewall one with 20.4. Right? So firewall two now. Here we go. See now the traffic is passing through from dot four, which is our firewall. If you look at the what is my IP again, it will be the same. Still, you are able to. Oh, 
right so this is what we have configured so far we have deployed our partner firewall from azure marketplace then we have configured the management interfaces after that we have configured auto scale for the management port because we wanted to use management port for auto scale and then we configured the health probe response for internal and external interface then we have configured our internal and external load balancer with the default port and in the testing we run the command put it trace route command to verify the next hop browser we have verified the public ip addresses and then end and we have removed the public IP from the firewall. Pass over traffic external load. So the last thing which I wanted to show you the health probe response. Right. So healthy state. So far it is not, but After a couple of minutes, it will start showing. Right. Like firewall two, we have just by the load balance. I believe firewall one is on. Early, early, of minutes start showing. It. So I hope this video will be informative for you. Stay tuned, keep watching.